Joint hearings of the House Select Committee to investigate covert arms transaction with Iran and the Senate Select Committee on Secret Military Assistance to Iran and the Nicaraguan Opposition will come to order. I took it to be a matter of an approved policy and one of which the government what must be witting. I'm going to save any comments till the whole hearing is concluded. The president would approve if asked. I made a very deliberate decision not to ask the president so that I could insulate him from the decision. I'm having some trouble uh, remembering that. I came here to tell you the truth, to tell you in this committee and the American people the truth, and I'm trying to do that, Mr. Niels, and I don't like the insinuation that I'm up here having a convenient memory lapse like perhaps some others have had. And I want to make it very clear that when you put up things like Park Lane hosiery, and you all snicker at it. And you know that I've got a beautiful secretary, and the good Lord gave her the gift of beauty, and that people snicker that Ollie North might have been doing a little hanky-panky with his secretary. Ollie North has been loyal to his wife since the day he married her. And the fact is, I went to my best friend, and I asked her, did I ever go to Park Lane Hosiery? And you know what she told me? Of course you did, you old buffoon. You went there to buy leotards for our two little girls. of the wildly speculative and false stories about arms for hostages and alleged ransom payments, we did not repeat, did not trade weapons or anything else for hostages, nor will we. A few months ago, I told the American people I did not trade arms for hostages. My heart and my best intentions still tell me that's true, but the facts and the evidence tell me it is not. I could not figure out how to run and not be separated from those I serve. I've concluded that I will stop being a candidate for President of the United States. I intend to seek the presidency of the United States in 1988. I, I would have been a successful candidate. And I know I could have been a very good president, particularly for these times. But apparently now, we'll never know. Money. Money. Money makes the world go around. The world go around. The world go around. Money makes the world go around. It makes the world go round. A mark a yen, a buck or a pound. A mark a yen, a buck or a pound. The zones that makes the world go around. That clinking, clanking sound can make the world go round. Money, 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 money. Tokyo opened up lower because they're afraid Hong Kong would go lower than Hong Kong went lower, so Tokyo kept lower because Hong Kong went lower, London opened lower because London opened lower, we're going lower, and Tokyo might open lower because they're afraid we're going to go lower after having gone lower today. What I'm saying is it's a vicious cycle. <laughs>